podcast guys are here and say <laughs> I'm reviewing uh the iPod Shop from 2015, this one right here, this is 2012. So um besides I got this because the this bag is starting a lot faster. This is thing I'm gonna review on anything else guys. And you might notice an increase in quality, which simply because um I'm recording an iPad and this video up can this thing can upload videos a lot faster than the MacBook I usually use, which is um let me get let me show you. This one, it's, uh, I think it's 2006, 2007, 2008, might be, I don't know. But, um, to be honest, sit here. And I noticed the cables in the background, that was like, um, well, that was like for the iPad. And the, this is not my iPad, this is my grandma's iPad, but yeah. Um, you see, this is what the Opera Trevor comes with. Uh, I'm not sure what the official name is, but it's basically it this thing right here. I plug this thing, it's supposed to be the headphone jack, the, um, the charging jack and the syncing uh, thing. This is the voice for button. Uh, you want to single tap it to um, tell you the name of the uh, song or the track or whatever you listen to. And the artist. <coughs> Sorry about that, guys. And um, you have a tablet to tell you the battery. So I'll show you an example of that. Let me just do that. And, I, and it, it, it will sound different depending on uh, what computer you have and what's. I guess you can actually maybe all to the same as well. You can just connect this to my speaker. Turn it on. So, as soon as you hear, hopefully you can hear this. Let me just turn it up a little bit. Cool. Battery 75%. Battery 75%. So, hopefully you can hear that. Yes, guys. It's not the best battery life, to be honest with you. But, um, as soon as you hear, it's probably the same battery life. Thread, that was the black one, this is the red one. This is a Oops, wrong thing. Yes, it was about 75%. Uh, I don't know if you know, guys. But I'm definitely a good iPod. It is uh, currently $49 on Apple.com. Obviously, a little bit more exp I think it's free shipping as well. Uh, <laughs> which is interesting. This says I think you can probably save, it on, save money on Apple.com and then buy it in the Apple Store. Or probably buy it on Target. I'm not sure about the Apple Store though. I don't know what the Apple Store is. If the prices of the um, Apple.com's Apple Apple website, because I don't go to the Apple Store that much, but I don't know, to be honest. So, here, guys, this basically is you press this, this is the play, pause button. And some people don't like show this, and it actually it says in the instructions this is the play and pause button, but there's a, thing, a trick you can do that practically even Detroit Burg. Uh, doesn't as shown. It should be says you hold this. It's supposed to make a lock sound, and that means you can't really do anything with it until you unlock it. With that, you turn it off and turn it back on. So let me just show you. Let's move the head. Oh, and it does come with earbuds, by the way, guys. Just thought I'd mention that. And well, let me just pause real quick. Stay so here, guys. Let's see if I can. I'm gonna turn this up again. Sit here. Hold it. Hopefully here, like, guys, let me just turn it up real quick. Hold on, let me just turn it up. It's not too loud. It's a present. Oh, gosh. It's got big speakers. No. I want big speakers. Wrong thing. Oh, gosh. Well, stop, stop. Okay, so basically, let's hold this. Hopefully, guys, can hear that sounds quiet at home. Um, oh, it's a little interesting. Okay, so I was to hold this. Hopefully, you can hear that. It's a basic kind of makes a click sound. Oh gosh, I usually can't. Um, that this must be unlocked. Just hold it. It's not working. Oh, and then it makes us sit here. Why is it not working? On. It usually works. So yeah, now it's locked. That was confusing. See so here, you can't use any of the buttons. Um, you can't press pure pause. And I'm actually hooked up to the speaker. It's actually a pretty good speaker. I'm thinking about Target. It's not an Apple. Apple, 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 Apple. No, it's not on Target's website that I checked. It's twenty dollars at Target. It's a pretty good uh, portable speaker, at least right now. But um, it's a Jensen. I think I'm probably pronouncing that wrong. Speaker, twenty dollars at Target. You can get it. I see that's the uh, speaker I'm using right now. Yes. Um. She can't move anything. 
And to unlock it, you want to hold it. Either that, or you want to hold it. It doesn't stop playing. Either that. Sorry if the camera's shaky, because like, I'm recording this on the iPad, so yeah. So you turn it off, and then you can turn it back on. So next function, the main function, is that this is, oh gosh, this is play in order. Sit here, and this is shuffle. And it has a clip on the back. You know, sit here, and sit here. Which, I mean, I don't really use it, but it's not the best clip. Obviously, I, mean, I try to attach it to my shirt, but it's most likely going to fall off. Uh, I guess maybe uh, you could attach to something, I don't know. Uh, there's a lot easier ways to, there's a lot more safer ways to attach this. But I definitely don't recommend it if you, I mean, this is a, probably the best. Uh, like, if you run a lot, it's probably the best uh, iPod Shuffle, best MP3 player out there. Um, simply because it is, um, very clean. It's small, and it actually, I actually, over time, at least I know, the hot like, so I know how to, like, control the iPod Shuff, I know how to change the songs, by not even looking at it, you can just feel it, and then, based on, and you can just change, based on what song's playing, by voiceover, by live double tap, this button right here, so you can change songs without even looking at it, which is good, so, um, it also is 2 gigabytes, obviously a little bit less, I mean, the iPod Shuff is right now, probably 1.8 gigabytes, Gigabytes since it does take up memory to hold. Keep in mind, although with all electronics, it will the max memory will be less than the stated thing because it takes take it takes software to like the actual software for it to work. Space so like even USB drives. Let me find one in here. So even USB drives, it will be a little bit less since it needs the software to work. Because if a USB drive didn't have software to work, it would actually would not work. Like plug in would not like know how to work. I mean, so it's that this is like 15.5 gigabytes, uh, and it's uh, and it's a USB bar, USB drives, uh, computers, anything electronic, even SD cards. 16 gigabytes right here, and it's actually 15.5 gigabytes uh, total because of, it takes software to um, know what it's doing. But I see you guys next time. Hopefully, this video does not take too long to upload. Should take a lot shorter. Um, probably should be like I don't know. Hopefully, it's I hope I probably will be shorter. Actually, yeah, this length, if I'd be like, it's taking a lot shorter than if I could this on a camera 700, for, I mean, even, yeah, or even 720p at this time, or even 480p, I think, I don't know. But hopefully this is a good, hopefully this reviewed the Apple from 2015. I, I mean, I don't know what I want to get for my birthday yet, maybe another Apple Shuffle because this battery is, like, almost dead, like, it's, it works, but this is 2012, not 2015, this is 2015, 2012. But, um, yeah, guys, if you guys see you next time, please comment, rate, subscribe if you have not, and like if you want to. And, um, also, um, just in 2015, they released a whole bunch of different colors. Um, if I remember, that's if I remember, hopefully I do, I will, well, I obviously have to go to Safari. Oh, wow, that's weird. Okay, I'm just playing around with the light functions of the sci fi. Wait, that makes sense. Never mind. Um, I will link in the description where you can buy this iPad Shuffle. Actually, no, I will link in the description where you can, um, yeah, I'll link where you can buy it. Uh, the Apple.com, or actually I won't, I will not, just look up Apple.com, and you should be able to find it there. Actually, I probably should have put it out there, yeah, I will. But i see you guys next time, uh, I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye!